Okay, Brock, uh, watching you swing here and and have one suggestion for you moving forward. Um, and then there's one other thing that I'm going to ask Woody to take a look at and, and defer to his judgment on that. So as I watch you here, as you put your foot down, uh, what I would, would recommend, and your style is a little bit um, unique and that's certainly fine, like don't need to change style, but as, as I watch what you do here, so as we put our foot down, as I watch our front hip slide, I'm looking down in, in, in that area here, the relationship between your top hand and your back shoulder, and what I see is, I'll just let it run, you can see as your hip slides forward there, as your heel's coming down, okay, I'm starting to see how the weight's transferred here and how a gap has been created in there. So as you look at where we are when our heel comes down, that doesn't look like the most powerful position to, to, to hit from. It's like we've wasted a little bit of energy by just transferring it on the, the flop from here to there, okay? So again, as I just watch our weight distribution, for as our heel comes down, that weight's come forward and we haven't really gained anything. Then, again, I'm watching the distance between your top hand and your back shoulder in there. As your weight comes forward here, you can see how right in here, there's some space that's starting to be created. Some space that's starting to be created, right? And it's good in that you're not coming forward, right? It's good in that you're not coming forward and I see that your back elbow is dropping independent of your hands. And that's really good, right? But I think that, that in, Woody will be able to explain it better than me. So like what's going on here is pretty freaking awesome. Again, I look at elbow and I look at your hands, okay? But if we could just get turning instead of flopping, because as you watch what I just arrowed, see how your elbow drops? Elbow drops, elbow drops, elbow drops, hands haven't moved, hands haven't moved, hands haven't moved, hands haven't moved, right? But we could take out the expenditure of energy here. So if we just got down and just turned while we were doing that, instead of just flopping forward, then we start to really, we're starting to turn from here. But I think we've already wasted some energy and our direction, it's still pretty good as far as keeping palm up, palm down. But as we watch here, and I put this arrow, I'll try to do it that way. Ah, crap, i try that again. Put this arrow to your chin. As you watch, as you're hitting the ball, you can see how you're going pretty pronounced back. You can see all of that movement that you get with your head going back. That's what I wanna to talk to Coach Woody about and, and, and see what he has to say about that. From, from what I see is if we could, because I love this, I love how that's dropping and that's not moving. I think that's great. But if we, could be, if we could be making a little better movement, I think with our lower half, as opposed to just having that kind of flop there, then as we turn it, see how we're just going back a little bit. And, and let me go to the next one here. Okay, so... Same thing, we hit there. Now I'm gonna watch what happens there and the distance that's created there. So we flop down, okay? And I just think that that's just energy that we've wasted because I love the way that that action works, you know? And, and on this one, I mean, your hands were a little bit better on the last one, but we're still seeing elbow get ahead of our hands, which is the most important thing there, right? But I just wish that we could just turn rather than just have that, that flop and hit from there. Because as we've created some space, again, we do a pretty nice job of maintaining our palm up, palm down. But I want to talk to Wit about this, how we watch our chin relevant to that arrow how we're going back as we're getting through extension. It was a little bit more pronounced than some of the other swings. I'm gonna ask him to take a look at it and see what he thinks. I just think that we could get a, 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 be a little bit more efficient if we lost that part there. If we lost 
that part there. That that's the only thing that that uh, concerns me a, a, a little bit.